Hello, today we're taking a look at AOMA's Partition Assistant. This is a utility that allows you to safely partition hard drives uh, through multiple versions here. We're going to be just specifically taking a look at the AOMA Partition Assistant Standard Edition. And uh, we're going to go ahead and demo that and show you just how that can help optimize your PC. So here we are looking at the Partition Assistant. Again, this is the Standard Edition. And right from the bat, it will go ahead and showcase all of your drives that you have on your machine. Now, you may be asking yourself, what exactly is partitioning and why would you need it? Well, partitioning is essentially breaking up your hard drives into multiple parts. So you may have, for example, a 500 gigabyte hard drive, but you might want to split it into two logical drives. So for example, 250 gigs for a Windows install and maybe 250 gigs for either, you know, data or a backup drive or, um, you know, maybe another version of Windows or even Linux, whatever you want to install on there. It's essentially partitioning or breaking up your drive, your physical drive into uh, digital sections that you can use to, again, install data on or install other operating systems. So you can see here, you can view all the disk. This will show you the disk number here. It'll then show you the file system that the disk is under, the capacity of the disk and how much is used and how much is free. Uh, and then you can go through here and see the other disks as well here. So you can see I have other disks here, disk two, disk three. These are all other physical disks. You'll also be able to see a visual representation of these disks down below. And if they have existing partitions within them, you'll see right here, for example, this partition and this partition exist within this disk two. So I have one partition here one partition here and again what's really great about this is it makes it easy because aside from just the numbers you have a really great visual representation of your primary partitions other logical partitions or just unallocated space that can be used now when you're working with a disk here you can see on the left you have multiple wizards you have the ability to extend a partition wizard you can do a disk copy wizard this is really good because if you want to copy use space of a disk to another disk it's really great for backing up you can do this really easily or you can just have it copy all sectors of the disk to another disk, no matter if it's used or not. So if you want to make backups, for example, you can use a uh, you know tool like this to do that. Um, you know, they also have the straight up partition, like I said, the partition copy wizard for you to run through that. They also have the partition copy wizard if you just want to copy um, a specific partition, not necessarily the whole disk. So you have options there, depending on what you want to do. Um, if you want to migrate an OS to an SSD, so for example, let's say you bought a new solid state drive. These are traditional, um, these are faster than traditional drives because there's no moving parts. What you can do with this is you can migrate the operating system, let's say Windows, for example, to an SSD. And this makes it easy because it moves over all of your, you know, files and your system files to a new hard drive that's faster and that will optimize your PC for better performance uh, without having to worry about how your data and every, everything gets kind of migrated over. So if you're looking to upgrade your PC from a standard hard drive to an SSD and you want to be able to do that seamlessly, go ahead and look into that. Um, you have a partition recovery wizard. So if you need to recover a specific partition, you can look into that if something got deleted. Um, you can convert the partition type. Now, this is something more specific that you would only need to do if you, again, needed to convert a specific partition to a different file type for a reason like, you know, installing Windows or what have you. But this allows you to convert to NTFS or FAT32 uh, both ways, essentially. You also have the option to make bootable media. This is really great if you want to put like Windows 8, for example, on a USB drive. You can do this via the Partition Assistant tool. And this makes it really easy because if you have a Windows, uh, you know, install and you don't have like a CD drive, most computers nowadays, you know, don't have the CD drive. You can install Windows and make a USB installer very simply with AOMA's uh, Partition Assistant here. They also have a tool called the Windows to Go Creator. Again, simple thing, but very similar. Just making a bootable USB drive that allows you to boot Windows 8 or 10 from a USB drive. Really great if you want to create like a recovery drive or if you just ever need it for like troubleshooting. It's always a good thing to have in your toolkit. Under that, you have other disk operations. You have the ability to disk copy, very similar to what we showed up above. You have the quick partition tool. So again, if you're looking to partition, you can see this really does it all here. It gives you all sorts of different options for partitioning a disk. You select the disk you want to partition, uh, determine how many essential sections you want to partition into, check your disk type, uh, and then you can set aside the partition sizes here. So if you want to break it up evenly, if you want to break it up for, uh, you know, 
different sizes here. It's all up to you. And you can even label it. So if you're doing it for like backups or videos, um, a lot of times people will have partitions set just for data. So for example, I have a specific partition just for backup data that's separate from my operating system partition. Uh, and again, you can get creative and do it however you want to do it. If you want to do it to dual boot operating systems, you can do that as well. This also has a built-in wiping tool, so you can completely wipe a hard drive if you want to, and you can specify how many times wiping, depending on how many times you want to overwrite the data. This does a secure wipe if you overwrite it more than once, so that's another great tool to have in there. You can do a disk surface test. You also have the ability to convert it to a GPT, rebuild master boot records if that's damaged at all, a really great uh, troubleshooting tool. And of course, you just have the tools to go ahead and look at your disk and you know get properties, resize partitions, split them, copy them, format them and so on. So again, there's a lot of tools built into here and a lot of disk options. Whether you're looking to partition a drive for a dual boot system, maybe you're looking to get multiple versions of Windows or Linux for troubleshooting, you're looking to make bootable USBs or just repair a hard drive and look into the partitions, this has all the tools for you. Also, don't forget when you head over to the site, you can actually go ahead and check out the edition comparison and this will break down all of the different partition assistant versions for you. For example, standard, pro, light, server, unlimited, and technician. They all have different features and support. So for example, they all support the basic formatting and partition tools, but you'll see some allow for other options like merging partitions in the command line. Uh, migrating OS is you know limited to certain features here. And then when you get into the higher ends here, for example, if you want to support more than one PCs or even servers, you might want to look into the higher end versions depending on what you need. Again, partitions are really, really, a, you know, an essential tool when it comes to, um, you know, breaking up your hard drive to rather than buying multiple physical hard drives, uh, to break up your hard drive into multiple digital sections, essentially, or logical sections. So. It's really great to have a tool like AOMA's Partition Assistant to help you do that, to make it done easily and seamlessly all in one place. And don't forget to click on our link down below to try or buy AOMA's Partition Assistant. And keep in mind when you order, you have 256-bit SSL encryption when ordering, so it's 100% secure and a 90-day back unconditional money back guarantee. So again, really, really worth it there. And whatever version you get, as long as it's a paid version, you have lifetime upgrade support. So again, once you decide on that version you want, whether it's technician, server, professional, etc., cetera, um, you get, again, unlimited lifetime upgrades. So definitely worth it. Be sure to check out our link down below. And as always, thanks for watching.